Do you like the cover? Yes. Yeah. Right, what do you think about the photo shoot? What was your idea before and after? Well, I just was so impressed because this one is so professional, absolutely wonderful. She came with clothing for the boys, came with clothing for me, but we decided to go with my own little blouse. And while I was getting ready to do my own makeup, she was in there entertaining my children and having a blast. Her photographer was great. And I was so happy to learn about the magazine because it didn't exist when I had my babies down here 13 years ago. And now it's been about two years. Just when I announced on TV because I was getting really big. And who knows why, who knows, but it was like 19 weeks and I think I have to accept it just wasn't meant to be. And then seven months later, we were blessed with these boys. Again, naturally, they said, you'll never have a multiple pregnancy again. That was just a fluke. Well, there you go. So I was so blessed, though, and went on bed rest, did everything we had to do. They still came super early, and we were in the NICU for four and a half months. And because being in the NICU and being home, I mean, it was really a juggle to try to be in the hospital all day long and then race to the news, and then come back to the hospital for dinner and then try to see the babies and go race back to the news. And I just saw Dwight Lauderdale the other day, and I thanked him so much for getting me through that time. It was crazy. So my kids won't ever remember all that, but I know, you know, all these years and all the things that have gone on to juggle all this together. And it's worth it when you have a career like mine, a really exciting, wonderful career, where they've sent me to South Africa to cover Nelson Mandela's passing. I covered Pope Francis's entire first U.S. visit to New York, and then Philly, and then Washington. I've covered the earthquake in Haiti, and I've been everywhere. It's wonderful that a local station invests. Like I know that I'm still always going to be on television. I really imagine myself more becoming a spokesperson for some different organizations, some different charities, 